Shalom. Have you ever wondered why Avraham was so intent on burying Sarah in Marat Machpelah? We read in this week's Torah reading about the intense negotiations, the emotional negotiation that Avraham had to go through in order to secure that specific burial place. What was it about that place that compelled Avraham to work so hard to have Sarah buried there? There's a strong thrust in the Midrashim that teaches that Adam and Chava, Adam and Eve, were also buried in Marat HaMachpelah. Perhaps Avraham was trying to leave the world with an important message. On the one hand, Avraham recognized his unique place in the world. He was the father of the Am HaNivchar, of the chosen nation, of a group of people, the Jewish people, who have a special responsibility towards each other and towards God. Avraham also realized that he was part of humanity. Perhaps Avraham wanted to make sure that his children and grandchildren, while maintaining their fidelity towards each other, towards B'nai Yisrael, would also remember that they are part of humanity. Adam and Chava, Adam and Eve, are not the father and mother of the Jewish people. They are the father and mother of all of humanity. By securing Sarah, a burial place, in the same spot where Adam and Chava are buried, Avraham is teaching the world that the Jews have a dual responsibility. A responsibility towards each other, towards their specific covenantal community, and they also have a responsibility towards the rest of humanity as symbolized by the presence of Adam and Chava. This also helps us understand why Avraham insisted on paying for Marat HaMachpelah. After all, as Rashi suggests, Avraham could have claimed that the land belonged to him. After all, God had promised it to him. But that promise, Avraham realized, was part of the B'nai Yisrael aspect of his life, was part of the unique covenantal relationship that Avraham had with God and with the rest of the Jewish people. Avraham wanted to secure this burial place with a universal method, and therefore he entered into a business transaction in order to acquire Marat HaMachpelah. Once again, showing the world that Avraham takes his responsibilities and his relationships with all of humanity seriously. So there is something very important for all of us to learn from Avraham's actions. We must take seriously our responsibilities towards our fellow Jews. That is what it means to be part of the Am HaNivchar, of the chosen people. But we also have responsibilities toward the rest of humanity. We also have responsibilities of citizenship, responsibilities that make us accountable to all. It is a dual burden that we bear, and we are reminded of it in Avraham's choice of where to bury Sarah. Shabbat Shalom.